Hi. Oh my goodness. Hi, hi, hi. I see everybody. I see everybody. Nawaona sana. Nawaona sana, sana, sana. Hi, 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 hi. I see, I see uh, 19 people, 20 people. Let me see. Mbona see only comments. Okay, Mary Wabui anasema hi. Hi, how are you? Yeah, I don't see any other comments. Oh, I see them. Uh, uh, somebody else. Um, somebody's, let me block somebody here. I'm going to block that one. Juicy, do you Oh, your nanny. I don't even know what he's writing there. Okay, guys. Uh, see your Mimi says hi. Say hi to Ben. I don't know who Ben is. Okay, Ruth Mary. Hi, Rebecca Karyuki. Hi, Great Hope. Tata Jean. Hi. What were YouTube? Mkoapi? I don't see anybody from YouTube. YouTube. Our Jaingia. I am here. Prophet uh, Overflow. Hi. How are you? Long time. Hey, long time. I haven't seen you in a while. Zipora Wangari. Hi. How are you? Uh, let's see. There's somebody on YouTube. Mm, yeah, I see you there. Pinky, please. Hi, how are you? I see one person on YouTube. I see you, Susie. Blessed uh, family. I see you uh, watching on YouTube. I can't wait for your shows, Susie. Eh? Margaret Kamau, Karibu sana, YouTube. I see you there. I see Catherine Mugure Akopale YouTube, Karibuni Sana. And the sound is actually much better on YouTube. Kama ujai yedawa yumaneno. Eh? Marewa Jerry, sema, sema. Uh, Diana Kahugu, hi, how are you? Um, I'm waiting to see if there's anybody else on YouTube. Yeah, guys, Karibuni Sana, we have a uh, chai, tukona chai leo. Yeah, I have not listened to this story, so I don't know what's going on. But this, the thing is, this mother who says that her children were taken away from her, alikuwa meenda job, kurudi nyumbani, ala, watoto wa meenda, watoto wa meenda, by a gospel singer, eh, huyu anaito wa Saaken. Recha nyingi, I see you there, Jane Mukima, I see you there. Sasa huyu Saaken, who was the husband? I mean, it to me, picha yake ya harusi, walifanya harusi ya kanisa. And apparently, uh, took the kids and ran away. Maybe they may have had some issues in their marriage. I don't know. All marriages have issues. Fresia, gitao, I see you there. Lakini huyu baba ya watoto, alichukua watoto akahepa. Eh? And he's a gospel singer. And he's married to another gospel singer. Anaitwa Judy Blessing. Now, the interesting part is that mama ya, ba, mama ya baba ya hawa watoto is on the side of this woman. Eh? Yeah, nasema, you know what, watoto warudishue mama yao. Watoto warudishue mama yao. Eh? So the ex-mother-in-law is siding with the ex-daughter-in-law. Anasema, apana, watoto warudishue mama yao. Haya. Wacha ni mpigia simu, let's hear her side of the story. Disclaimer, everything that will be said here, it's not wairimo kimani. So don't quote me out there. Eh, nini ma bloggers, don't quote me out there. How are to see wajui? This mother came in my DM, akaniambia, you know what? I need my kids. I really need my kids. And I really have to have my kids. And I said, I'm going to offer her a, a platform. Akuje, atueleze, ni nini naendelea? Because mimi wairimu si mjui. Na si ni nini naendelea? Okay? Now, uh, we have had such cases before. Hmm? Kama ila story ya Daudi wa Chris. And that matter was resolved. By the way, your story was resolved. They went to children's court, and I think they had an agreement where Rita, eh, who was the ex of Daudi wa Chris, is now allowed to see her child. Hmm? Kwa hivyo Facebook works. Hii maneno na makelele ya Facebook, uwe inafanya kazi. Oh, I didn't mind your own business. No, we are seeing results. And where there are results, hey, we are going to have to go on. Eh? Kama justice ya Kenya imefail, hey, tuko na midomo social media. And we can make the noise and, hey, attract, I don't know who out there. Like I said, this other side is welcome to come and respond. Okay, so we are hearing one side of the story. Hi. Wacho wainimu wapige simu. Ama call this uh, mama anaitua. Ooh, she's going to tell us what she's called. Mm, atatuambia bile anaitua huyu mama. Atuambia what the heck is going on? Because if somebody took my kids, 
I'd be going crazy. I don't even know how her mind has remained intact. I don't know. I don't know. How do you sleep? Hmm? How do you sleep and wake up in the morning and don't see your children? I don't know. Hmm? Hello? Okay, hello? Hello? Can you hear? Unaniskia? Unaniskia vizuri? Oh, sijui uh, kwa nini unasikika ukiwa mbali. Unaitwa nani? Naitwa Paris. Unaitwa Paris. Yes. Paris umetoka wapi? Uh, nimetoka Moranga County. Aha. Uh -huh. Kandara constituency. Okay. Yes, Mukango village. Haya, sasa Paris, nataka tuingie kwa maneno kwa chai ya leo, staki tuwanze kuhujua ulizaliwa na nani, wea ulizaliwa, ulijipata. Praise the Lord, you are alive and well. Now, huyu mtu tunaongea habari yake, anaitwa nani? Huyu mtu tunaongea habari yake, anaitwa Kennedy Joroge Ngeze. Kennedy Joroge Ngeze. Aha, anaitwa Kennedy Joroge Ngeze. Aha. Na na huyu Kennedy mlijuania eh, wapi? Okay, tulijuania na yeye kanisani. Aha. Na uh, we got married in the year 2015. 2015 ndio you got married. Yes, officially the harusi kanisani. Harusi kanisani. Yes. Na ilikuwa ni kanisa gani? Iko iko hapa Juma Maneza kaja jina. Yeah, kwani iko nini? Aha, uh inaitwa -huh. GNCC. GNCC, huko ndiko uli, uliolewa mkiwa na huyu Kennedy uh, Ngeze sijui. What was the other name? Jerome Ngeze, Kennedy Jerome Ngeze. Muliolewa huko Zimmerman. Okay, eh uh eh. -huh. Alafu uh, in 2015. Yes. 2015 December. 2015 December. Aha. Uh -huh. Kuna mtu anasema, ebu ngoja ni... Uh, alafu, haya, wakati mliolewa mkaanza ndoa vizuri, mlikuwa mekutana, mlikutana kanisani. Yes. How long did it take uh, ndiyo muwane? Mulikaa muli, muli sana by the time muli, muli, muli juana? Apana, we, we were in a courtship for, for like one and a half years. Oh, you were in a courtship for one and a half years? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. So after that we got married. And then you got married. How was your how was your marriage? Okay, uh, uh, in the first place our uh, ship was okay. Uh huh. There were no uh, uh, red flags. There were no red flags. There were no red flags at all. Yes. Uh huh. But after we got married, uh huh. I I happened to conceive now our firstborn. You happen to conceive your firstborn. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. So up around uh, February 2016, uh -huh. I found out uh, he has an affair. Allah, uh, this firstborn. Simon my pregnancy was around two, three months. Haya, hold that thought right there. Na huyu Kennedy, unasema he's a gospel singer. Yes, he's a gospel singer because we met in church as a born again Christian. Uh -huh. So I have known him as a church guy. Mitu mwenye miyokoka kapisa. Hey. Yes. Na alikuwa nasavu kwa hiyo kanisa ya Zimmerman. Alikuwa nasavu kwa hiyo kanisa ya Zimmerman. He's the prison worship team. Uh huh. Yes, as, as, a, as a vocalist there. As a vocalist there. Kwa hivyo pasta, wa hiyo kanisa anajua hii maneno yote? Hakuna kitu hajui because I've been complaining for ah. all those years. Uh -huh. I've been complaining to him, but uh, unfortunately, I don't know how to put it, but haja yuweza kutuita kitu wata wawili tutakuwa na tikao. Na huyu Kennedy badu anaenda kanisa huko? 
haendagi kanisa huko for now ande mama sasa i think they are wana fellowship sasa na huyu judi mwenye wako na yeye na kwani wako na kanisa i don't know i don't i don't know you need a church for now uh yeah sije sije kwenye wanaenda church sasa Haya so and na huyu 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 sasa the the bibi mwenye alioa anaitwa Judy Blessing. Yes, Judy Blessing. Na yeye pia ni mhubiri sijui ni mwimbaji. What is she? Oh, she's a gospel artist. Gospel artist. Yes, and also she has a she has a channel on YouTube. Eh. Where yeah. by currently she's a, she's preaching there. Wait. Huyu Judy Blessing has a channel on YouTube kwenye anahubiri huko. Yes, on, on daily basis. Yes. Allah, uh-huh. Yes. Okay, now, <laughs> haya, sasa huyu Kennedy unasema mlipatana kanisani, mkawana kanisani in 2015, eh, ali, uh, and then yes. in 2016 uka conceive, and then you rea, uka, uka gundua he has he's he's been side chicking up on a side chick huko nje side chick nje nikapata chat na nilipo muuliza ah alichapa sana ukiwa mjamzito aterere alikuchapa sana ukiwa mjamzito eh alichapa kabisa kabisa na mshipi kabisa kabisa na mshipi now na huyu Kennedy jina yake ya 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 u artist ni gani anaitwa nani anajulikana kama nani anajulikana kama Saken Saken yeah he's also an MC he's also an MC yes we okay yes Saken ni, ni wimbo gani kama ameimba hivi ameimba okay kuna yeye ame shoot recently ah uh unajiita isipokuwa ni wewe she's also on youtube oh he's also on youtube yes he okay sasa wakati uli, ulipata kennedy is side chicking and ameanza roho ya punda ku side chick yes. eh ukamuuliza yes. akakuchapa akanichapa kabisa akanitatika vizuri sana nikiwa mjamzito na mshipi kaivava eh Yeah, so so mimi nikapigia nikapigia mawazo wa wazazi wake. Aha. Uh-huh. I'm so sorry because for now his dad passed on last year. Aha. Uh-huh. Sasa wazazi wake ni pastors. Wazazi wa Kennedy ni pastors. Yes. Where? Eh. Yeah. Right now they were they were having in a in in a, in a certain church in Moranga County. Aha. Uh-huh into a prince of peace but now the dad has passed on okay and 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 no offense atutaki kuingisha wazazi hapa because this has nothing to do with the with the parents but, but do the parents but know that okay so so you called wazazi wake ukawaambia msi amekutandika and and then what and then they came they talked to us we reconciled aha uh-huh. And I thought I forgive him because he promised to never repeat such kind of stuff again. Okay. So I didn't know I have been, he has been cheating on me. Uh. He's been so violent, anakuja, ananyombo misamaha, and since I am a born again Christian, now it's on the hair. Haya, so he's been cheating. Yani akona roo ya punda, na anasavu kanisani ana sasa kanisani even to a point asha ni cheat na msichana wa kanisa wa prison worship mwenye wana staff na yeye kanisani hii kanisa ya JC inaitwa JC what Jesus JCNCC GNCC stands for what Gospel News Community Church ga, ga, na iko iko wapi Zimmerman au oh, iko Zimmerman yes Uh, and this Kennedy guy was cheating with the one of the singers huko. Exactly. Kai. Na pasta alikuwa anajua hii maneno. Hakuna hakuna kitu kijaapia pasta. He's aware, he's aware of everything I'm telling you. Na 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 bado ali, alikubalisha waendelee kuimba. Kabisa 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 je hakuna hakuna time shai shai niita kuniuliza ama kupita nini nao and Kennedy tukae chini tuongee uh, he's never 
hey okay haya uh, and then sasa uka uka muka reconcile mkaendelea msia kaendelea ku cheat akaendelea hivyo 2017 the same thing 2018 the same thing yani he has been like that kukukukukua na upunda na bado anakuchapa yeye yeah, anakuwa na bado na bado anachapa haya akiulizwa akiulizwa hata kikuulizwa yeye anataka tu kwenda huko kurukaruka na kuranda randa Hey, uh-huh. So, nikapata nikajifugua fast bone. Fast bone is it a boy or a girl? Fast bone is a girl. Aha. Uh-huh. Nikajifugua fast bone around August 2016. Aha. Uh-huh. After two weeks of a few months of I gave bad. Mhm. Oh, nikapata na depression. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, my first day. I, 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 I was admitted for one week. I was there with my kid. Wow, with your with your child, when you for one week due to depression. Na hii depression na Ken. Yes, my pregnant journey. Ah. He was always violent. Let me say that. He was violent and he was serving in the church. Hapo ndipo nataka tuelewane vizuri. Eh? Kabisa kabisa hata kuna Saturday Saturday alinichapa Saturday usiku. And on Saturday he was on the altar. Na pastor anajua hii maneno yote. Yes. Wa, aha. Kai sasa ukalazo hospitali because of uh, depression na uko hapo na mtoto alafu kukaenda namna gani my friend so uh, after that i re- uh, thank god i recovered aha but kaendelea kukaa na yeye and of course tulikuwa bado tunakaa na yeye akiwa bado kwa hiyo life yake because i it's like he never changed ha uni ask you ukisema kennedy was cheating on you ni ni, ma- ni phone yake ulikuwa unasorora or Were you snooping on his phone ama he was cheating live live like ile ya live ukweli kabisa Okay you are chat mm. Okay let me see in most cases we go and do via his phone Oh ulikuwa una snoop his phone sasa unaona maneno huko Yes He aha uh-huh. Had you ever confronted the side chick, one of the side chicks? That one from our church from the prison worship team, I confronted her on a Sunday and I called Ken too. Guy, akasema nini huyu msichana? Of course, he told me that the guy had told him uh, hajaoa. Hii! Yeah, so what we tell her is that I'm the wife. Yeah. Because that Sunday it was a family Sunday. Uh-huh. And uh, the dress that the, the dress the dress that I had worn it was going to match na shati ya huyu ya huyu ya huyu Ken. Uh-huh. Sasa so, akaanza kukuwa na wasiwasi ku die be the wife, die be the girlfriend so nikamwa nikamwa approach nikamwambia. Uh-huh. Yes. Wa wow, na aliachana na mme wako. Aliachana na yeye because she was so apologetic akasema yeye she was innocent hapo anajua tena ameoa. In fact we cannot blame her unless ali, ulifanya hiyo harusi she was was she a member of that church wakati ulifanya hiyo harusi? No she she came she came way back after we did after her, after the, we did our wedding. Haya, wacha tusamehe huyo side chick. We are going to on record we are forgiving this side chick because she did not know. She got into this thing yeah. aliingishwa na Ken. Ken amesema he is not married na side chick ameangukia yeah. mse and that's it. Huyo hatuna maneno na ye. So huyo she has been ex- ame, ame forgiveiwa. Huyo tuachane na sorry ya huyo. Eh eh. Aha. So now to come to the no that, that that has been my journey in marriage. Yeah. But allow, allow me to go direct now to have to hear the truth that I get. Yes, absolutely. Master. Yes, yes. So, so last year, mm-hmm. last year October we happened to go to his dad. Uh-huh. And three weeks after that, mm-hmm. 
my own biological mom died. Your own mother died. Uh huh. Yes, my own mother died. Uh huh. Allow me to say this, Wailimo. Mm hmm. Immediately after the body of my mom. Yeah. In my family, we are a family of four girls. I'm the second born. Yeah. So I later on found out that the same same kid mm -hmm. is cheating on me now with my own sister. Ate? My own sister, our last one, she's been found to a minor. Hiya. What? Yes. So I, I called this girl to, to my place now where I live. Yeah. Because you see, it is just right after the body of our mom. So, Nikasema, what is his tongue? Yeah. Because we want together. Asiatu, Nibani, Namsuye, Pekeake. God. Uh. Yeah. 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 Nikapata wanachati na buwanangu, so those love messages deep sana. Yeah. To a point that my sister has sent Ken her photo at you are naked. Aterere, ebu, ebu nipeleke kama mtoto hapa ndiyo ni, ni, I don't want to miss a thing. Reure, you discover that your last born sister is cheating with your own husband, brother-in-law. Na ume discover that amemtumia mapicha zake akiwa ndevi. Yes, I yes. went through her messenger, I went through WhatsApp, I went through normal messages. Uh-huh. But I did it, I did it in a way how I get you in Yenafanya. Easy. Because I took my sister's phone, you come on here, let us in Yako, you create a Wi-Fi password. And by the way, for those of you that are coming in, we are talking about a gospel singer in Kenya. Anaitwa Saken. Ukienda kwa YouTube yake yes. utampata hapa. Saken. Eh? Alikuwa anaimbisha praise and worship huko huko kanisa iko Zimmerman. Eh? And he had married this woman mwenye ako kwa simu sahi. And then he started cheating on her with a praise and worship, another praise and worshiper wa hiyo kanisa. And the news flash is that the pastor of this church alikuwa anajua maneno and besides him cheating on this woman, alikuwa na mchapa. Tuwe hamwe, nyinyi wanya mnasikiliza hii maneno. Sasa tumesonga kutoka hapa. Uyu sasa Ken ameshikwa na roho ya usenge. Ameenda sasa kuchit. Na the sister-in-law, eh, the last born sister of this woman that is on the phone. We are talking about a gospel singer. Gospel, mnasamanga gospel. Gospel singer. Ako pale YouTube anaitwa Ken. Ken is now cheating with the sister. Tumefika hapo, the sister-in-law. Aha, uh -huh. endelea. Wa. Wow. So, nilichukua simu ya sister yangu. Aha. Nikamwambia nimeweke password ya Wi-Fi. Aha. So, I went through all the social media platforms, Messenger, WhatsApp, no more SMS. Aha. So that's where I found out wame tumiena those messages. Mapicha za nani, za wakiwa, wakiwa, wakiwa uchi. Yes. Including your own husband who is a gospel singer and a, and a imbisha prison worship huko. Hame tumana na, na picha yes. yake, birthday suit. Yes, sasa, sisa kutia di mtumia picha yake akiwa uchi. Kai, aha. Uh -huh. Yes, sasa, I, I was very, I was very calm na shara wako wanajua wana ya maafu. Yeah. So, nikachukua, 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 nik Akanyambia, what is the meaning of that? Akanyambia, he doesn't know anything. Kwani, okay, uh-huh. Wah. So, I called my sister now to to our bedroom. Yeah. Kwambia, now, can you explain to me what is this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh, that's when my, my husband akakumama, akanipila, akanipila usimu kutoka kwa mpono. Ya. Yeah. Akapatia sisangu, akamuambia, haende huko mse na afute hizo kusote. Ok. Yes, so sisangu akachukua simu, akatoka nje, and of course, akadilisi, akadilisi all those messages and those photos. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. So later on, he came to my phone. Uh. I would. Yeah, of course. Na tena, she's a minor. She is in form 2. She's form 2 is wanakuanga na miyaka ngapi. I think I was 15. For, uh, 15 or 16? Yes. 15 or 16 ukiwa form 2. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, that, that was uh, now November. Mm. So, I put, I, I was unable to talk to this Ken again. Yeah. So, we were still under the same roof on December. Yeah. But different rooms. Yeah. So, this year, January on 2nd. Yeah. Uh, his mom came, came to our place. Mm -hmm. They requested her to come. Yeah. Talk about the affairs of the kids now, not about me and Ken as the husband and wife. No. Mm -hmm. She comes over, uh, we talk about our kids now. Yeah, your own children now. Yes, uh -huh. we talk about now, about how we raise our, our kids because I had purpose to leave that marriage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, mom came. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So for all those years when it was born and I yeah. Once, not twice, not thrice, I have left that marriage. Yeah. Oh, so we umetoroka maratatu. Uh, you will run away and then you go back. You run away, you forgive and go back. I run away, I go back to his place, to his home. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you take most of the, in most cases, you get Twitter, you get Twitter, you get Twitter, you get Twitter. Yeah. So, I am not ready to take the kids away because our daughter was in school. Yeah. And I have I have no house at any other people nilikuwa nilikuwa niende kukaa na my auntie. Oh, huko umejipanga. Siko nimejipanga. Aha. Uh -huh. But nilikuwa nilikuwa nataka kutoka juu ya uchungu. I was in a lot of pain. Yeah. So nikambia mama yake I'll give them the kids. Yeah. Because he has a house, Mr. Mwachia had a house girl, Mr. Mwachia kila kitu, but at least mimi niende ni kapta maari ni kuwe na amani kwanza. Yeah, right. So, alipo, alipo kia hivo, akasema, no, no, we need to be concerned. Akasema, very, you know, I love you, mimi, mimi. Mm-hmm, nye, 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 mingi. Yes, nye, 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 mingi, just because I'm scared, actually, on our toto. Uh-huh. So, mimi, when we mo, ni gandia mamake, it's okay, I will stay. You will stay. Yes, but I think I did not say that out of my heart. Yeah. I just said that Badu Nikipanga Benyanga like in a without him in my life. And how old were the kids at this point? It, it is this year. It is this year we are talking about this year January now. Yeah, but how old are the five kids? Years, five years and two years old. Five and two. Yes. Uh-huh. Because by the moment she took our kids, our, our, our last one was still on diapers. Kai, na alikuwa na bado? Alikuwa na but she was on diapers. Okay, uh-huh. So, so after, uh, after that, mamaki akatuombea vizuri. Mm-hmm. 
that uh, that month of January to Kaka Vizuri, but in my mind, I knew that I am not for this marriage. Yeah, yeah. But but I would face in no way possible as if you could do what I am up to. And during that time, was he still cheating? Amal yekuwa meacha, metulia? Because of the, this time, uh. Sasa walikuwa washa washa chukuana na Judy Blessing mwenye huu ni evangelist sijui ni pastor kabisa kabisa kosa mkia them calling each other but of course video is a change anything alikuwa ananiambia wanaenda ku shoot song sijui wapi na huru wanaenda eh like now Judy Yes. Now who you do did she know that you are legally married to Ken? Of course she knew. Kai, madho ya mutumia ni mutumia. For real. Yes. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. So sasa wakaanza sasa kwenda shooting those songs. Sasa ikafika point. Eh. Ken Ken ana anaenda na lala nje ananiambia ti ananiandikia message tunapata anaandikia message kwa Peter kwa sababu usiku ati apo studio anaimba anaimba saa nane ya usiku saa 8 ya usiku but of course nilikuwa najua wako na huyu juti wa okay aha so what time i did i did and quiet ni aha with the owner of that studio yeye alikuwa anasema kila wakati ati apo studio mhm So one time nikauliza huyo mtu wa studio are you with Ken akaniambia hapana hajamuona leo wow aha he told me that you of course wako na wako na yeye yeah so around around february february the second week mhm mm when they went for prayer with Judy instead of his wife walienda na Judy but me Eh lakini mimi Ken hakuniambia he is planning to go in there for prayer. Ah. Uh -huh. So nilitoka nilitoka job nikakuja kwa nyumba nikapata some of his clothes are not there. Mm. Ikafika ikafika sasa nyenye zoea anasimanga baby sapa pesa ya kununua sapa. Yeah. Nikapata haja kimo so nikapigia simu hakuchukua. Yeah. Nikapigia rafiki yake nikamuuliza hey are you with Ken? Uh. Akaniambia no Ken went for prayers uh. for three days he coming back for Sunday. Hajakwambia? Uh. Nikamwambia mimi I know nothing he has not told me anything. Uh -huh. So he went for three days he came back on Sunday. Mhm. Mm na binyaliingia kwa nyumba wa elimu that man alikutana kwa nyumba na nguo mpya worth 10000 zote alikuja na nguo mpya alikuja na nguo mpya kutoka boxa kila kitu yenye unajua mwanaume anafaanga wa aha uh -huh. na, na, na alipokuja hakuongelesha mtu including his own kids hakuna mtu mwenye alikuwa anaongea yeye na yeye kwa nyumba aha uh -huh. <coughs> huyo alikaliwa chapati eh kabisa so so on monday mi kama kawaida nikaamka na nikamwacha kwa nyumba aha nikaenda job yeah so kurudi mhm nikapata amechukua nguo zake zote mhm amechukua vitu zake zote za kazi yeah so there was nothing that belonged to him clothes that were there alichukua kila kitu But the kids were still there. But the kids were still there. Yeah. Yeah. So I I tried to reach out to him ni mulizi yako wapi? Hakujibu. Mhm. Finally I got a block. Hiya, hold on a minute. For those of you that are asking what the heck is going on here? I am talking to a lady, uh, a mother of two. Eh? She's telling us that she was married to a guy by the name of Sa Ken. Saken eh uh, Saken is one of the gospel singers wenye wako Kenya 
And this second guy is also a worship leader. Kwa kanisa iko pale Zimmerman. Eh? These people got married in 2015. And then in 2016, this woman conceived. Mtoto wake wa kwanza. Then she discovered that Saken ameanza upunda na ananza kuchit. My friend, the guy was cheating. So when this woman confronted her husband kumuliza kwa nini ana cheat, she first got a beating. Alipigwa kichapo cha umbwa. Yeah. So uh, aka, the guy akaendelea kuchit and nini and this woman uh, reconciled with him and uh, whatever. Just the same way, you know, marriage is about forgiveness. Kuvulmiliana kwa ndoa. Yeah. So this guy took it to an extreme. Akaanza kuchit na his sister-in-law. Yani, the last born sister wa hui mwanamki. And she's in form two. My friend, they were sending each other nude pictures. Akiwa baby, my friend. Yeah? So now, when this lady discovered that they were cheating with the sister, Nanini, and they called Sijui, the mother, the mother waken, wakakuja, wakaongea yu maneno, suri kaisha. Now she's telling us how now her life was after that. Vile, now she, she still stayed in the marriage. Yani yata si, hii roho yako ata imenishinda. Yani hii roho yako imenishinda. Eh? So we are talking about a gospel singer. Anaitu asaken. Ukienda pale YouTube, utampata pale. And who's also a worship leader. Sasa amechit, amechit, amechit. Ameanza kuenda kuomba uko sijui wapi. Eh? Amerudi ya kiwa chizi. Asha korongewa. Siju nini alifanyua uko. I don't know. Eh? Na mechukwana na mwanamke. Another gospel singer. Who is also a pastor or an evangelist. Huwa anapreach pale YouTube. Anaitwa Judy Blessing. Eh? Judy Blessing. So yeah. That's what's happening here. So those of you that are asking. Haya. Alafu. Uh, sasa tumerudi, Ken, Ken akarudi, amekua, you, like you don't understand, amesha aenda, amekuacha sasa. Yata na watoto kwa yumba. Aha. So, uh, hakuwa, hakuwa na wasapoti anyway, hakuwa yeah. na fanya MVP, hakuna kitu kitu kijeriku kumpikia. Yeah. Hakuwa, hakuwa ada respond. Yeah. You would alert his mother. So you are, you still have a, a, had a very good relationship with your mother in law. And I watch, Mama, and I watch. I want to salute this mother who stood with the daughter. I really want to honor her. Niseme Mama to Abarikiwe. Uh huh. So, mama, mikambia, mama, so, mama, kajaribu kumtikia pia, but pia yeye, akablokiwa. Mama, akablok his own mother. Wah, aha. So, after, after, he, after he left, sasa, on 1st of March, mm. so, akakuja home, nini, nilikuwa kazini, mm -hmm. Akakuja, akachukua nao our last one, sorry, sasa last one yetu wako two years had, bado hajaikia shule. Yeah. Akakuja kwa nyumba, akabia house girl, ati, anachukua mdoto mpeleke kiyozi. Yeah. Ata mbrutisha. Okay. Uh, the last one is a little boy. It is a little boy, so, and uh, our first one by then, alikuwa shule hiyo siku. Yeah. Yeah. Which of course which the Miss Chana had a movie or anything because of course. And he has a right to his children. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. So he went to school where our daughter was. Yeah. And lied to the director of the school that we are, we are, we are vacating to, from here Nairobi to Nakuru as a family. Yeah. He did even the transfer haraka. Guy, the director of the, see your shula in it one nini? Top Destiny Academy. Oh, Top Destiny. Iko wapi? Iko Zima Mantia. Oh, Iko Zima Man. So he went to Top Destiny Academy, a Kaitisha transfer letter. Uh, na alidanganya director. And obviously, the director atamuamini kwa sababu ni baba ya watoto. Sana, na mchua kama 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 mchua k
And I really want to thank a high court uh, advocate. Kuna a high court advocate. Amejitolea kusimama na wewe. On pro bono basis, you're not going to pay her anything. I really want to thank God for her. Thank you so much. So you, it's just amazing the people that follow this page. This is why Izzy Maneno Tunaziletanga Facebook. Because... You know, this woman maybe di didn't even have the money to hire an attorney. Lakini kuna a high court. High court advocate. Amesema, I will stand with this mother. She probably is another mother. She's a mother like you. Yeah? Na amesema atakusimamia. So I really want to thank her. I, I, I can't remember her name. But uh, nilikupatia namba yake na information yake. Umpigie si mukesho. So what are you going to tell this Ken guy? Kama atakutizama because tusha muanika. And I know this thing is going to go viral. Okay. Okay, Wailimo. Uh -huh. This is what I, I want Ken and Judith to hear from Paris. <clears throat> Ken and Judith to hear from Paris, the mother of the children. Yes. Uh -huh. I have no issue them having a relationship. Yeah. Not at all. Judy can have Ken for a lifetime. Yeah. The only thing I need from them is my kid. Yeah. And uh, I, I, I will let Ken to be accessing his kids whenever he wants because she's still the father of this kid. Yeah. Absolutely. So I want to tell Ken, yeah, so I want to tell Ken whenever you are, thank you so much for Yeah. Yeah. Um, the only thing I need is heavenly way remote and Jakim Mere, our chicks. 
I see them, I hear from them. It's been seven years. I don't know where you took them. Did you want to land? I mean, I don't know even where they are alive. God forbid. And you can, please, I need to see my kids. I want to have them. I don't have any issue. You and Judy getting married. Get married and, and have your own kids. I bless your marriage in fact. I bless your marriage. Wow. Yes, Wairimo, that is all. Wow. You know, it, it, I just thank God for your heart because in Gekua Nikama Wairimo Kimani, I'd be spewing every venom that is out there, casting them all over the place. But I thank God because you're yes. so calm. You're so calm under the storm. This is a huge storm. Now, when you have a roho yangu, roho yangu tulia ukae na buwana, even in all this so you are really setting up a very good example for women that are going through the same situation because wengine wana wanaenda huko wanatukanana 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 wengine because you know at the end of the day huyo ni baba ya watoto wako and he also has a right to the children what you're saying is that i want to be part of my children's life i want us to co-parent these children i am not taking the children away from you you are still their father but I want to be part of my children's lives because I brought them to this world. And you're also saying, I have blessed the ma your marriage. I have nothing to do with it. So we are pleading with this Ken guy. Ken, if you are listening to Erimo Kimani, you are a man of God, according to what is being said. Eh? Eh? you still have that little light shining in you. Tafadhali, please, open the lines of communication and just have a dialogue with the mother of these children. co-parenting. You really need to co-parent these children. You cannot separate these children from their mother. The children have nothing to do with your issues. You really need to stop this madness and allow this mother to be part of her children's lives. Amesema yeye ana haja na wewe. Asha ku release. Hiyo mlango asha funga. So you need to allow her to have her children, to visit her children, to be with her children. That is all she's asking. Ataki ndoa yako na ataki suri zako. So what are you going to tell your mother-in-law who has stood with you through all this your mother-in-law has been on your side? Ana kutizama hapa. What are you going to tell her? Yes, to my mom, Susie Wairimo Nyeza, that gift God has given me in my life. Yeah. You know what I have persevered, mom, in this marriage with your son, Ken. Mm -hmm. You know I was dedicated for this marriage to start, mom. I know we fought so many battles with you. Umetimama na mimi katika, umetimama, you've never disappointed me. The only thing mom is a kwambia to just umungu tu, uh, it's only God who can reward you mom. It's only God who will reward you for this. Yeah. And I will request you here on air, please mom. You know I was dedicated for this marriage. That one you know it. Unajua Paris, umenijua kutoka nikiwa mzogo. So what I'm saying here mom, I know you are a witness. So the, the only thing, mom, I, and as I say, my two, I still love you as my mom. I can't delete you from my life you may, because you still remain to be my mom. And a time like this, when I don't have a mother, my mom passed on last year. You are the only mother who, who I'm left with. So I can't stay away with you, mom. I love you so much. And may it only God, ni mungu tu atakuriwad, mom, because umesi mama na hiyo doa. 100%, you have never disappointed me. You have never quarreled me. You have been my best friend, and you will remain to me to be my best friend. Yeah. Yes. Wow, what a wonderful tribute to a mother who is also a woman of God, because you told us that your mother-in-law is a pastor. And I thank God for yes. such mothers-in-law, because they would be standing with their, their sons. When Gina, they chase away the, yeah. the wives and they will bring in the embrace the side chicken. But who you mama a messy mama now, regardless. Who you mnim totoake wa kujizalia, but she has stood with you because she's standing with truth. She knows what the truth is. She knows that regardless of anything, the children still need their mother. So we, we really want to honor her. 
and we want to just thank her to mwambia tu Mungu atu ambariki. Now what are you going to tell this advocate? Mwenye amesema I want to be I want to fight for this woman. I want to fight for justice. Utamwambia namna gani because she's watching. She's watching this show. Oh, okay to to that advocate I don't I don't know you. I'm sorry for that but I'm so I'm so Okay, imekatika simu. Ah, this is so sad, guys. I'm seeing some people laughing. I don't know what the joke is. I am trying to wonder what the joke is because we are talking about a gospel singer. Anaitwa Saken. Kimbiani pale YouTube. Muone. He sang some Swahili song there. Eh, ameimba wimbo ya Kiswahili hapo. Eh, anaitwa Saken. And we are talking about him unfortunately. He is a gospel singer. He is also uh, uh, alikuwa naibisha prison worship in a church uko Zimmerman. Na tunaongea na his ex-wife. Tunaongea his, na his ex-wife. And this Saken took away the kids and ran away. Hello? 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 Yeah. So ulikuwa unaongea na advocate. Uli, una, unataka kumwambia na mna gani? Yes. So yeah i never i never i never thought i'd get i'd get such a such a privilege to have an advocate who can fight for my for the rights of my kids yeah and who is and who is that with me so wherever you are may god see may god see your heart and uh, your kindness now may god bless you that's mm. all i can say amen amen we will say the same thing we will say the same we echo the same words that uh, this precious woman when you you know what i'm going to i'm going to step in and help this mother uh, to get justice we want to thank you we want to thank you for stepping up and stepping out and uh, and even for offering your services on pro, pro bono basis meaning she's, this woman is not going to pay anything it's for free so asante kwa sababu ya moyo wa huruma bwana akubariki sana so i really want to thank you for sharing your story i know this is going to go viral i'm also going to ask if there are bloggers out there that would want to cover this story unless who you can a communicate aseme ondoeni hii maneno kwa social media i have surrendered i am going to work together with my ex we are going to partner we are giving you a chance ken we are giving you a chance otherwise we are going to blow up these media stations. We are going to blow them up. We are going to cause a lot of noise and a lot of a lot of noise, my friend. You really need to open your lines of communication. I know you're going to watch this thing. I know you've already been informed. Uyu Judy, blessing uh, the wife or rather the side chick or whoever it is that you call her. But I know you guys msha ambiwa. So please, I know you're going to watch this. Open the lines of communication. These are things that can be settled out of social media because there are kids that are involved. So please do the right thing. I am going to follow up with this mother in the next two days. Kama hatu takua tumesikia maneno. My friend, we have a lot of people that would want to cover this story. Ini chai kwa ma bloggers na ma journalists. Do you really want to go through the shame, Ken? You want to go through that shame? You, Judy Blessing, who is a woman of God, unahubiri una uko. Do you really want to go through the shame? Eh? Ya kushinda ukianikwa kwa mitandao za wenyewe. Eh? Do you want to go through the shame? What kind of what God are you preaching? You as a woman. Na sijui kama una watoto wako, unalala, unaamka. Now you have kids that do not belong to you. You are supposed to be in the front line, eh? Eh, I know your husband is mad or she, he's going he's not very happy about the whole of this ex manenos but you as a woman who preaches the truth that sets people free you're supposed to be facilitating a way for this mother to be able to reunite with her own children that is what preaching is all about you start from jerusalem before we ingia kwa youtube utuambie yesu anaokoa my friend wewe kwanza okolewa okolewa well, na ken muokolewa na muokolewa vizuri sana, my friends. Eh? Before you tell us Jesus is saving, first of all, get saved. Because you're not saved. There's no way you can sleep. Umelala huko kwa kitanda yako, mkiwa na ken. 
eh mmelala huko kwa kitanda yenu eh namna watoto wamelala in another room na hao watoto sio wako i don't understand what god you are there has to be another god my friend but that's not the god that i serve that is not the god that i serve so if you are watching this because i know you are watching this or you're going to hear about it you are going to hear about it before we go to the next media station my friend you don't want it to get to another media station you don't want it to get there can it be resolved now it can because there is nothing that is impossible with god wewe umeimbisha praise and worship for so long i believe you have done it for several years you know the truth that truth that set you free because you used to take people to the presence of god with praise through praise i pray that that truth works in you right now it penetrates in the chambers of your heart and you do the right thing do the right thing do the right thing it is possible to do the right thing it is possible to co-parent these children and still have nothing to do with their mother it is possible mama ya watoto washa kupatia blessing amesema you know what and then nimolewe huko i don't care what i care about is the children that is who matters to me it's not you okay so where i can okolewa tena before we go to the next media station kwa sababu unajua ma bloggers wanangoja hii maneno do the right thing do the right thing so anyway nataka kukushukuru thank you so much for sharing your story today ah uh, and we are praying that in the next two days you will hear from this ken guy because i know he's going to watch this he's going to watch he's going to watch this broadcast and i'm praying that before it actually escalates that he will deescalate this situation and open up the lines of communication but make sure you go through court because this thing has to be in writing we, we need to know the whereabouts of the children he might decide to keep them but all you need is a relationship with your children lakini hii ni maneno inaweza kubaliana huko kwa court this is the reason why we have courts courts are made for this so i'm going to wish you well and keep me posted uh, i gave you the number to the advocate call her tomorrow ndio mweze kujua vile mtasaidiana na hii maneno sawa sawa okay Yeah and may the lord bless you what are you going to tell our viewers when you wana kutizama saa hii Okay Yeah Okay thank you thank you so much eh uh, Wairimo Yeah I'm a, I'm a follower of your page and I never I never dreamt that one day I'll be yani I'll have contact with you I thank you so much for what you're doing Yeah And uh we go to the word for that Asante sana. I'll I'll need to say something to maybe to those who are watching me. Yeah. I know um, they are they are some of the friends of mine they are messaging me here I know they are watching me some some or already some had called me during the day. Yeah. I I forgive those who are rebuking me I forgive you for that. Mhm. Mm and uh, at least now you have heard now the kind of pain i had mm -hmm. and uh to single ladies i will still tell you that marriage work marriage yeah. is not bad marriage work mm -hmm. have no fear to get into marriage just pray god when before you get into marriage and for those who are already in marriage mm -hmm. kindly make your marriage work absolutely but don't die but but don't die in that marriage amen yes wow those are beautiful 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 closing remarks make your marriage work but don't die in it that is very powerful i have learned something new today make your marriage work where well, mary done my friend make your marriage work but don't die in it don't die in it if it's not working hey out in nature out nature utalia kama ambulance lakini utapona na utaendelesha maisha so th thank you so much for for coming to my show today i am hoping that this has captured the hearts of ken and judy kwa sababu huyu judy ni mhubiri i'm praying that the spirit of god will minister to her sisi we are not here to condemn her we are here to tell her do the right thing together with her husband or her men to do the right thing If they do the right thing I will pull down this video eh tumaliza hii maneno out of 
social media. But I really want proof that you have reached out to this mother and you have fixed the situation. But don't reach out to them alone. If you hear from them, make sure you involve the advocate. Do not usifanya uh, maneno kienyeji. Make sure there is something in writing. Make sure there is something in writing, at least from a court of law. Otherwise, may the Lord bless you so much and I wish you well. And stay in touch with me. Let me know vile maneno iko kwa ground. Sawa, sawa. Thank you so much, Lady Mo. Aya, God bless. Okay, my, okay, okay, okay. Oh my God, yeah. So those of you that were asking what was going on, you can go back and watch the video again. But yeah, that's a man of God. That's a man who sang praise and worship in a church in Zimmerman. And the sad thing is that the pastor of this church, he knows everything that has been going on, still allowed this guy to sing in the praise and worship. Still allowed him. That is the... That is, those are the pastors, some of the pastors. Let me not generalize, but those are some of the pastors that we have in this generation. It is a shame, big shame. Am I blaming him for Ken's behavior? Absolutely not. Ken is an adult. He is an adult and he can do whatever he wants to do. Okay? So anyway, uh, I'm praying that this guy, Ken guy, Nahuyu, uh, Judy Blessing, they will watch it. And I pray that Hawatalala, until you do the right thing. Until you do the right thing. Now may the may the spirits of this child and they are alive, they're not dead. Lakini murudishie mama yao. This mother needs her children. Eh? This mother needs her children. If you Judy blessing, you are a mother. Can you imagine if your children are taken away from you and you have no access? You have no access, you have no communication with them. Do the right thing. All right, guys, thank you so much. This story is also available on YouTube. Uh, if you are a blogger, if you are a journalist, uh, yeah, and you want to cover this story, it is available. I can give you the contacts of the mother. But I'm hoping that we will not get to another media station. I'm hoping that this will be settled. Even in our day, that was settled out of social media. But hey, it will depend on this guy. It will depend on you. Come out akubali hi chai ishi up. All right. So guys, thank you so much for tuning in. All of you that are watching via the, uh, YouTube, Mbariki Wesana, thank you for your YouTube support. We are almost at 11,000 subscribers on YouTube. Thank you so much. It is because of your support that the YouTube channel has become very, 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 very uh, fast growing. I want to thank all the pastors who are watching. Eh? I want to honor the pastors who are watching. You can drop your comment there. Eh? Encourage this mother. Yeah, encourage her. She needs to be encouraged. Seven weeks without your children. Oh my God, I would be on. What, what is that medication that we use? Uh, Mary Dan, yeah, yeah, nini, yeah, depression, that antidepressant. Uh, medication, yenye tunatumia hapa. Very common medication for anti antidepressant medication. I would be on that by now. There are people who are so strong out there. So strong. Hmm? Yeah, there are people who are very strong. Lakini watu wa meumbua differently. Otherwise, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much for tuning in, Doro. I see you there. Faith Kibet, Ako YouTube, and Derek, I see you there. Eh, watu wote wenye mnatusizama, Mary Dan, Pastor Patricia, I see you there, Wancha, Dagi, Nakuona sana, all of you that are watching. Mbarikiwe sana, chaya leo imeisha. Tuona nekesho, by the grace of God. I am gonna do a video on YouTube. You have to watch that video. If you have not subscribed, I have to come on YouTube today. Kwa sababu kuna maneno nataka kuongea. Na hiyo maneno sita yongea Facebook. I don't want to be blocked by Facebook. I want to do it on YouTube. So if you have not subscribed, subscribe. Yeah, it's going to help the single ladies that are waiting on God for marriage. Please, the single ladies that are serving in the church, you have to listen to that video. I'm going to do it and I'll post it. Bye-bye. Anbel, thank you for watching. Regina Mburu, asante sana. Have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.